so the build night is something that we do here at, at my central vape lounge to allow people to learn how to build so we're talking about building coils the coil will need to buy wire or cotton and rather than buy a manufacturer's stock coils or pre-made coils you can make whatever coil you like so as opposed to buying a set ohms or set resistance you can dictate what kind of vape you want to create um, you know based upon the materials you buy you know the way you build the coil so build night we do it twice a month it's six in the evening till 8 p.m it's a two-hour session um, it's free and it's just about teaching and helping people with safety how to get the most from the tools that they might own any accessories that they've got for coil building and it's just sharing the knowledge that we've got and helping people to build safely because it can be dangerous if you've not got a good understanding of ohms law you know battery safety etc so co coil building is for people um, who want to get the most flavor um, so dependent on the materials that they buy so the type of the wire um, the brand that they use you know the, the, the cost you know very common you get what you pay for they might own a, an RDA which is a dripper so you build your own coils and put the cotton through it um, and you drip directly onto the onto the coil might be that people want to build coils for RDTAs or RBAs you know it's, you get much better flavor um, you can save a lot of money so as opposed to buying let's say four or five coils for sort of plus 10 pounds 10 15 20 pounds depending on the tank that you own uh, for 10 pounds you could get a whole meter of cotton you could get 10 meters of wire you could build endless amounts of coils with that um, so it's for people who want to save in the long run and get you know more flavor as well the, the only downside to that is just that depending on how you build you might use more e-liquid if you're saving money from buying the manufacturer's coils then it sort of balances out may not be ideal for people who are you know on the go um, it's more of an at home thing because um, when you make your own coils you know you might have problems with like leaks and things like that if you've not built the coils and you know set up your dripper or accessory right it's not a something that you would sort of carry around you know there's no capacity as such um, with a dripper as opposed to a tank unless you've got an IDTA or ITA so build night is for everybody, maybe you're new to building and you've never built your own coils before or set a dripper or you know any tank let's say, you can basically put your own coils in. So it's for the novices or maybe even seasoned veterans, a uh, very common saying you know two heads is, is better than one, um, you can always learn something new, um, vaping you know, the, the e-cigarette um, industry has got to be one of the most evolving you know, sort of trades right now. Um, so you've got to understand that there's always something new coming out. You know, you've always got much more choice because it's evolving at such a quick pace. So it could be that you're, you're an expert, but it could be that there's someone there at the build night that could help you. Or maybe you've got questions, even though you're a seasoned veteran in vaping and you, know, you want to quash any concerns or, you know, um, clarify certain things that you're unsure of. If you've got something in your hands and you know, it's much easier than watching a review or how to build on the internet because you're experiencing it yourself. You know, you're, you're, you're immersing yourself. You know, it's for everybody basically. Whether you're new to vaping or you've been vaping for you know, seven years plus, like, like myself, uh, there's always something you know, new to learn. Uh, so it's for everybody. It's, it's good for people to learn how to build because they can save a considerable amount of, of money. Um, when you're buying a premium e-liquid, it's important that you get as much flavour as possible. You wouldn't want to put really nice e-liquid that may not be cheap into a coil that's on its way out or it's not going to last too long. Um, so it's all about flavour and you know the quality of the vape that you want to experience so it, it, again you know with when you build your own coils you can set exactly what style of vape you want maybe you want a cool vape a warm vape hot vape a, a very wet uh, vape that leaves a lovely taste on your palate you know you can dictate how smooth you know or what type of vape that you want to create 
So it's all about doing it yourself, you know, tailored to you. So when you learn, you know, how to build, you dictate exactly, you know, what you're building the materials you're going to use for that boat as well. You've just got many, many more options when you build your your own um, your own coil. Um, it's really important to understand resistances. Um, know which type of batteries to buy when you're building your own coils because it can be dangerous if you don't have a good knowledge of you know building safely you know using the right type of batteries we won't sell the hardware to anyone here unless you can demonstrate to us that you, know, you understand those law and you've got a good knowledge of how to build coils and, and utilizing the correct batteries um, you know for, for the coils that you're building so it's about understanding resistances etc else it's like literally shorting a battery and of course you know the, the, this danger surrounding that if you stress anything too much it's eventually going to break uh, that's why we see a lot of accidents um, in the media uh, maybe social media as well um, you know shops have sold the products you know to a customer who's want, wanted to get into you know this style of vaping but they've not explained to them, you know, or, or given them a good basic understanding or uh, vetted them to see if they're competent to, you know, utilise these accessories um, in a safe, uh, you know, way where they're going to get the most out of it. Um, so it's, it's, it's important to understand Ohm's law um, and battery safety as well. Um, if, if you want to attend the build night, you would need your own dripper, RBA, RDTA. If you've got to have your own hardware, um, we have got the tools, but we're limited. Everyone comes pretty much with their with their own DIY kit uh, or coil building kit. Um, so people would be happy to share. You know, I'm sure um, the community that we have coming here on the build nights is it's brilliant. You know, everyone's like a family. Um, everyone helps each other. Um, we never you know, head down getting that hands-on experience, making clap tunes, um, and every week it will progress. So, you know, your skills are constantly improving. Um, so what we'll, you know, what we'll do on the build night is gauge what level everyone is at and, and try and give a task where everyone's going to achieve, you know, the most of that two-hour session. We, you know, we put out some of the latest e-liquids and we ask for some feedback to gauge whether we should get them in or not and you know, it's, it's good it's a really good atmosphere uh, and people you know really love it and, and we've got a good loyal you know, following for the girl guys as well um, so we we announce the dates on facebook every two weeks on a friday so there's two you know every month uh, and we put it on our facebook page which was at atmos space central um, so people can just send a request We'll add you, and you'll see some of the latest hardware e-liquid that's coming in, and we'll announce the dates um, that the build night is on, uh, to allow people enough notice and the opportunity to attend.